However, as our Western Region reporter Fred Omulo now reports, out of the county, little has uh, is there to write home really about cane farming and its benefits to the locals. Take a look. Migori County is one of the most economically active counties in the southwestern region of Kenya. Its financial muscle primarily derives from the intensive investment in the sugar sector, coupled with its strategic location at the Kenya-Tanzania border. But this hasn't always been the case. Cheap sugar imports in the 1990s and mismanagement at the local powerhouse Sony Sugar, as well as cane poaching, almost crippled this sector. During those years, cane used to take as long as six years in the fields. And so many farmers incurred huge losses. So they came in and uh, they breathed that gap. In the last five years, two new millers have joined the fray without conducting intensive cane development, increasing competition for the available crop and taking advantage of Sony Sugar's weaknesses. We had intended to do an expansion of this uh, factory and the government had actually promised that we would get funded this funding did not come true and therefore we went ahead and expanded cane because you know obviously you have to start with the resource sony sugar the oldest player that was once a monopoly in the region sustains approximately half a million residents scattered across four counties its dismal performance in the 1990s and early 2000s placed it squarely within the privatization sites of the kibaki administration but with the current turnover of seven billion shillings many stakeholders here are changing their view the government wanted to privatize them because they were a burden on the exchequer. So now given that Sony is able to stand alone, we want to reserve it to the farmers. Let the farmers here who own it. Sukari Industries in Homabe County and Transmara Sugar in the neighboring Narok County have joined the fray, opening up new farming areas in places like Ndewa, Nyatike, Kuria East and Kilgoris constituency. Of the six counties that make up Nyanza province, Bigori holds the greatest promise considering its location and the economic potential that it has. With the onset of devolution, only time will tell what the future holds. From Awendo in Migori County, I am Fredo Mulo.